Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add to the voxel train or remove from the voxel train. I'll make another video after this um, if I get 50 likes. So if you go to your third person character, left mouse button and right mouse button. Okay. So let's go with the left mouse. So we are going to remove from the terrain. Uh, so we put we do sphere by sphere trace by channel third person camera okay for location get forward vector And this is going to be the start location. And then we're going to multiply this. Like, I don't know, like 1000. Let's see how, let's do like 2000, 3000. And then we're going to add. This is going to be the end of the sphere trace. And we're going to enable the draw debug to for duration to so that we can see what's happening. Connect this. Um, radius is up to you. I'm going to go with 30. Okay. And let's break this or uh, split it. And then we're going to drag the heat actor and we're going to cast to voxel world. All right, so it's going to do cast to voxel world. And for the left click, we're going to remove. Right, we can do that. Uh, for remove, we can do drag out of voxel world, remove sphere. Um, so we can take either heat impact point or heat location. And uh, let's take uh, impact point, see if this works well. And the radius we're going to go with is 100. Uh, and that's pretty much it. And I think for um, for the right click, we're going to just copy everything beside the remove sphere sphere. And then connect to this. Instead of remove, we're going to do add sphere, right? It is position, radius. Okay. Uh, we can do. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, let play. So assuming that you already have a voxel, world, you know, just go to voxel, drag this into the world. And you have some sort of materials. You don't have to have materials, but you have to have the voxel board. And there you go, right? You know, if I left click, there you go. It goes there. Where where it hits, and then we can do right click. Adds, right. Let's try something. Let's um, click on the the voxel world, and if you go to the details panel, you have um, render type. If you switch to cubic cubes, cubic. So this is how the Minecraft world will look like. Since it's flat, you don't see anything. But if we add a um, uh, we don't have to. Um, if we add some noise, you will be able to see this. It has like cubic kind. Now, if we do, you know, if we do terraform, it's not doing anything because there you go. Now, if I right click, it does add it, right? There you go. Now, why left it doesn't add? Strange. Okay. 
Let's reduce the voxel size from 100. So the, this is the voxel size. The cube, the cubes are big. If I do like 10, right? And there you go. Now it's more fun. As you see, the cube, the cubes are very small now, and the left click works well. And you can play around with the radius to see what fits you the best, but you know this is like way smaller than what you have in minecraft uh, then left click will add this this looks way funner fun than this smooth terrain right like you can create your own like this like a maze garden that you can create we'll create a new voxel graph um so voxel graph so and we're gonna do basic tweet pruning X hold Y press left click and then right click 2D pruning noise if I do this here and then Z left click minus this seven to that um now we can do if this is less than zero add multi index to one else this zero okay so we're going to play around with the the first two the lower bound will have one and make sure if you click on the voxel wall make sure your voxel size is 10 it's going to work with you know 100 as well and the uh, render type i'm using this setting render type is cubic uh, so the why new terraform okay let's do control f5 and before that make sure you assign your new graph this is the new graph so this is how it looks right uh, now we're using 10 by 10 so it's less than 0 we said that and press start is here okay there you go so right now wherever you impact wherever your impact point is going to do that specific in here is going to do that Start of fun stuff. All right, yeah. So that's it for this video. This was a quick video. I hope you guys found it useful. Uh, I'm going for 50 likes. If I get 50 likes, I'm going to make another video right right away. Whenever I get 50 likes. Uh, until next time, goodbye.